Hey guys, it's Chris from Tech Takedown, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to glitch a chest into any sort of block in Minecraft for the Xbox 360. Now to do this, you are going to need the blocks that you are working with, so I'm going to be doing this with stone. You are then going to need a piston, a minecart with chest, a couple of rails, and a button or a lever or basically anything that can activate the piston. You are also going to need a wall that is at least three blocks high. Now this doesn't always work the first time, but if you stick with it, you should be able to get it. So you're going to start off by mining out two blocks like I do here. Then you're going to take out your piston and you're going to place it so that it is facing downward. After that, you are then going to place your button next to the piston or your lever or whatever you are using to activate the piston. Then you are going to take out the rail and place it on top of the block. You want to be sure that the rail is horizontal to yourself, so you might need to dig out another block in order to make that happen. You will see that once I place another rail next to it, it makes it horizontal. I can now get rid of the rail I just dropped and insert the block back. Now you are going to take out your minecart with chest and you're going to place it on top of the rail. You want to be sure that it is perfectly in between the two blocks as well as not sticking out from the wall. You can see that it is perfectly in line with the wall, but here's an example of a minecart that wouldn't work. You can see that when I place the minecart, it is in line with the wall, but the edges of the minecart go into the block, so you're going to have to take it away and try again. The cart needs to be perfectly between the blocks like it is here, and then you are going to break the block below it. Once again, it needs to be perfectly aligned with the wall. Here's an example of a cart that wouldn't work. The cart looks like it's perfectly in the wall, but once I break the block below it, you will see that it does actually stick out from the wall, so you'll have to try again. But if your cart is perfectly in the wall, the last thing you have to do is place a block above the cart and then activate the piston. It will push the block over the cart, making the chest be inside the block. You can then get rid of everything and fill in the rest with blocks, and now all you have to do is press left trigger on the block that has the chest in it, and it will open up. So now you have a nice hidden chest that only you will know about, and you won't have to worry about guests stealing your things. Well guys, it's been Chris from Tech Takedown. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll catch you in the next one.